I'm married. We don't care. We don't care. In fact, we do not care. It's time for love after lock up, baby. I don't only do love after lockup. I have hundreds of videos on my channel that are not about love after lockup. I talk about everything pertaining to life. So I have various playlists. Go over there, go and browse, and I'm sure you will enjoy what you find. Destiny and Sean, we have reached the season finale and they left all the ratcheroo for the end. I am saying Destiny and Sean, but I might as well say Destiny and Sean and a whole bunch of side pieces. Here we go. We're at the courthouse. Destiny's in there. Um, they won't let anybody in because of COVID. And so um, I'm just waiting. I, I don't like I get so, because uh, I never know what's going to happen. These people must be giving these people lines. They must be telling these people what to say because in a minute you're going to see how none of what this woman said made sense. Who is recording her walking with her shoes like that? Who said, you know what we'll do? We'll take a microphone and just mimic the sound of heels. Let's just take some heels and go. Because that makes no sense whatsoever. But anyway. Oh my gosh. Wow. Because what happened to the sounds of her shoes all of a sudden? Nothing, because it was fake. All of a sudden we can't hear it anymore. Mm-hmm. Who are you calling a bee? Who are you calling a bee? We don't care. See that stuff that I was telling you guys about that Chevelle was saying, I'm a gauge. I'm a gauge. Wrong. Look at my finger. I'm a gauge. Have you seen this ring? I'm engaged. That's exactly what she's saying. I'm married. We don't care. We don't care. In fact, we do not care. <laughs> I'm married. I was talking to Jason in prison before I kind of, you know, made a commitment to Sean. Things so what? Why would you be with this guy who is around your age, and then also be with Sean? Why not just go with this guy? Is it not crazy? Now we need to peep this because this is. I think I can't even remember if this is one of the pictures that Sean saw on Facebook. This account literally says Jason and Destiny, and then they've blurred out the rest. I just think that's very curious. I bet it says love after lockup <laughs> behind that too. Um, I think it's, yeah, I think they just made this new Facebook thing just so that we could find them and follow them. You know how people be trying to get followers and stuff after they do these shows. Between Jason and I about a month ago, since I left Vegas and I came to Reading, every single quality that Jason- hmm, These filters are doing their work, oh. <laughs> <laughs> now you know darn well that y'all don't look like this in real life. These filters are putting in work. <laughs> okay, let's continue. <laughs> that was so bad. Uh, Sean Lux, there's no lying, we're open, you know, and just the way that he treats me, talks to me is, <laughs> there is no comparison. My favorite thing about my wife is uh, her heart for other people. Huh? <laughs> he said, <"It's> <laughs> you guys are lying. <laughs> you guys are lying. He said the favorite thing about his old wife is her heart for other people. What are we talking about? Are we talking about the same destiny? Is she a twin? Is there another one out there? Is there another one out there? I'm genuinely confused. Who this guy is talking about? I think there's a lot of purpose in our relationship, you know, you know, restoration in our family and helping others as much as we can. That's part of that. Is he an actor? Is this another one of the paid actors? I don't know. They really shouldn't be calling things reality TV if it's not going to be reality. No. Don't insult our intelligence like this. Who the heck is this guy? Is it they're around the same age? Look at, the, look at this woman. Look at the mom. You with your fake scripts. She's going into the courthouse. I don't know what's going to happen knowing darn well that this woman is going to get married. Look at you now waving, waving and doing all kinds of uh, interesting things. You're so happy to see your daughter finally marry, yada, yada, yada. And then now she's coming to tell us a whole bunch of nonsense. I'm hopeful that uh, it'll work out. We won't know until it doesn't, I guess, now. <laughs> we won't know until it doesn't. <laughs> mm -hmm. 
That's one proud mama and mother-in-law. I don't know why you would say that. That's just like putting a fluke on her relationship and her marriage. But okay. Call your sister. Tell her the good news. Okay, I'm gonna call everybody. So the sister is not there either. I mean, at least she could have waited outside of the thingy majiggy. Also, why are they not having like a little celebration, a little get together? They just got married, right? It's not adding up, man. They just used the same truck that Christiana and John used. And just, <laughs> just put some stickers and things and all this decoration and you can't fool me. This thing looks fake as anything. I don't plan on telling Sean because Sean couldn't pay me enough for all the that he's put me through and all the lies and the pain that he's caused me. So any chance I get to get whatever I can from him, I will. I hope you get nothing. And he'll still do anything and everything for me, so it is what it is. And I feel like, you know, if you're so worried about your 50 grand, you might want to be careful because I could just not show up for court and you'd be... <sighs> Listen, she keeps threatening him with that thing. Meanwhile, it is you that is going to be in trouble if you don't go to your court hearing because they will just slap on a few years on your top of your sentence. They don't care. You're the one who disrespected the court in that case. Not him. Yes, he might have to pay, but he'll have his freedom. I've said this before, I'll say it again. He'll have his freedom. And you'll be like, hmm, wait, when is it? When are the cops gonna show up? Because now I'm a fugitive, I'm running away, trying to dodge my court. Who is winning? Who is winning here? Well, 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 who is calling Sean? So, um, I am currently in the Lake County Jail because they- Who is this? Twin Destiny or Destiny Destiny? In any case, she's in jail. Ha! She's in jail. She's back there. I love how this guy was just like, huh? <laughs> like, you don't say. <laughs> so, her stomach is supposedly in knots right now. And she's freaking the heck out. This, I've heard her say this exact line before. So I think this is something that they just do, right? They're in prison and you're like, mm, but they're in prison and they don't have their freedom on. Oh, it's so sad. Wish I could help her. Oh, her stomach is in the toy. So stomach, okay. I was just freaking the heck out. Oh, let me make it better for them. But Sean is not having any of it. Gangsta Sean. He's back. I am freaking. I feel really bad that this needs you back in prison. At least I'm off the hook for the, the bond and the $50,000. At least I'm off the hook. Yeah, we're gonna hear that for one more time. One more time. One more time. One last time because this is something that he said, I think, approximately 150 times. We're gonna hear it one last time. For the, the bond and the $50,000. I really can't. I'm taking my power back. Destiny, she's not gonna take advantage of me no more. All you guys are the same. I gotta go. All you guys are the same. No, the common denominator is you. All guys are not the same. You just pick them weird. And you yourself act weird and do weird things. That's what's happening here. So then he hangs up on her. Sean, I was like, oh. then he gets a prepaid call from. Why does it sound like another collect call? Now hold on a minute. Sorry, day one. They should end out soon. One month. There's been a few things that I haven't told Destiny. So what do you want to do when you get out? <laughs> I met Sarah and Destiny through the Prison Pen Pal website, and I've been talking to both of them since then. Even though my first relationship turned out to be a complete con, I have hopes that the next one is the real deal. Okay, I love you. So these people were conning each other. You know what? Whatever interesting things life will throw at them hey they call it upon themselves they called it upon themselves your child that was crying all that there will be a time you she'll be like that who i ain't got a dad who are you talking about i hate to say it i hope i don't sound ridiculous i don't, I don't know, know who, who this man is, is. He walking down the street i wouldn't wouldn't know a thing sorry to that man saying. that's what's gonna happen to you <laughs> cheeky smile we don't care in any case, let's get an update. So Destiny's up for parole in five months. And she's still married to Jason and continues to ask Sean for money. As the, <laughs> the leeching person that she is. Mm -mm -mm. Sean is excited to meet his new girlfriend, Sarah, at her release. So this is a couple that I'm thinking we might have seen. We might not have seen the, the, the end of it. Um, but it's going to be a long, long, long road 
to happiness for either of these people and i think that's what they're showing now they got the drones out to show us a road that's long 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 to show us that yeah it's gonna be a long road with these people mm -hmm. ah, sean and destiny it was not a pleasure meeting you <laughs> this was this was terrible um you have caused the love life after lockup community a lot of stress okay us people followers fans of the show you've caused us a lot of stress we have just seen ridiculous contradictory things you've both been conning you've brought children into this mix into this craziness it's been it's been actually horrifying horrifying <laughs> watching your relationship what can we learn hmm let's see um Anybody that will take you away from your children? No. Nah. That's what the heck you're not going to be doing. Take me away from my kids? No. That's 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 not a relationship. And then come to find out that she has five children of her own somewhere in this world. Horrible. Because she doesn't care. She doesn't care. She cares about herself. That's allegedly. Possibly. Supposedly. But yeah. It, it's, it's just been terrible to see this. I don't know what else we can learn from these people. Don't be as gullible as Sean is. Don't be so gullible. And don't be so mean as Destiny is because that karma, that karma just comes back to bite, man. It comes back to bite. Now she's back in prison. It's it's actually wild. It's wild. But at least she's up for parole in five months instead of the seven years she thought she was going to get. Now, Jason, I don't know what he's on. I don't know what side she's showing. Maybe she showed a different side to this Jason guy because she has to get serious in life at some point. She has to get married and settle down at some point. She can't just be tricking and, and fooling people and conning people all her life. So she picked one guy to be her true self with. Nice, caring Destiny who likes to help others, as this Jason guy was saying. And then chooses to be mean to another one. To just still have her mean. You know, you need to keep those, eh? Those thuggish ways. You know, the, the, that 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 thug life, that prison life had to come out of her somehow. That she can show that, ooh, I can still be cunning, conniving, and mean. And get my way and get what I want. And that is what she had with Sean. So she was playing two different, she had two different faces. And she utilized both of them and went through life that way. No way to live. Pick a side, pick a lane and stick to it. Preferably a good side, the one where you're helping others. She would have loved to see more of that during this show. But yeah, um, I hope Kelly gets her $2,000 back. I hope he sells the ring and gives her that money back. I hope he rekindles his relationship with his children but on the other side i hope he doesn't because there's a lot of gaslighting and just nonsense that's going on there and it's just not fair and also he's now talking to another inmate as well and he thinks that that woman is not gonna con him but we all know that she probably will but my thing that is interesting is that obviously we're probably gonna hear more from these people they're probably gonna show up in the next season because it is very interesting that this one just got married out of the blue and this one has another inmate on the side so yeah probably we've not seen the, the end of these people we have not <laughs> we haven't seen the end of these people but hey ho iri what iri um we're definitely gonna see them again i think i think um but yeah i think him being with another inmate and it's gonna be more drama and more using and he's gonna forget all about his children again for a minute he's gonna be with the children for a minute now that she's not out yet but when she gets out he's gonna forget all about his kids and be chasing another woman and i'm sure she's another young hot thing that's not a young hot thing um, that's not in his age group at all so yeah get ready for how to finesse sean part two because that's definitely gonna happen supposedly allegedly yeah well this was interesting we learned a lot we saw a lot it was entertaining it was sad don't let anybody play like this. That's what we can learn from this. In any case, if you're not already part of the family, make sure you hit bump stop as on that subscribe button. Comment because I really want to know what you think. Like because you obviously like this video and hit the notification bell while you're at it. I'll see you in the next video, which will be tomorrow. Daily videos up in here. In the meantime, make time for glorious life. It's time to start what? Living it right. God bless. Mm -hmm.